Let's start. Today we will see a moving average screener in the trading view. This is what the screener looks like. What we have done is, in the background, we have a 200 length exponential moving average. In the screener, we select any 10 stock script. Then this indicator screens and tells us, which of these 10 stocks are either above or below the 200 moving average. Here you can see that, when I was recording this video, except for the HDFC bank, all the other stocks were below the moving average. Let's see the input panel of this screener. First, here you can set the moving average length. By default, it is set to 200. Then here, you can select the 10 stock scripts. At the bottom, we have the option to change the table position and the table size. We can change the table position in these many ways. And we can change the table size in these many ways. Let's cross-check if the screener actually works or not. I have plotted an exponential moving average on the chart, in the blue color. Right now we are on the nifty chart. The screener says that the nifty is below the moving average. And we can verify that it is actually below the moving average here. Now, we are on the HDFC bank chart. The screener says that this stock is above the moving average. And we can verify that it is actually above the moving average here. Now, we are on the reliance chart. The screener says that this stock is below the moving average. And we can verify that it is actually below the moving average here. Now, comes the fun part. I have added the indicator twice on the chart. In one of the indicators, I kept the table position in the middle of the screen. And in the other indicator, I kept the table position on the right side of the screen. So now, at a time we can have two screeners. And in both the indicators I have chosen different stocks. So now, at a time I can screen up to 20 stocks. If you want you can add the indicator one more time, select different stocks in it, and place it on the left side of the screen. If you like this screener and want to give it a try, do let me know. My contact details are in the description below. Thank you.